Good morning. So the council has spoken and they have decided that we are going to be doing Pritchett's Canyon. So we're gonna go uh, look at it, see what uh, it's all about, and hopefully we finish it. So stay tuned. Are you ready? I'm as ready as I'll ever be. <laughs> Where are we going? Pritchett's Canyon, <laughs> hardest trail in all of Moab. Oh, Don't kill me. <laughs> mm. The first few obstacles were pretty easy compared to what we've already done prior in the week, but man, we were in for a treat with some crazy, crazy obstacles. Driver, driver, hard driver, hard driver, you're going to drop off. Nope. The next obstacle was a bunch of ledges that you had to maneuver down. A great spotter to let you know where your tires were is definitely needed. Now we did put a strap on the two-door Jeep just to make sure that there wasn't any tip-overs early in the day. There you go. Back tire's gonna come up. Come back. Oh, there's no turning around now. <laughs> For you, at least. Yeah. <clears throat> I mean, you could winch that rock. So, I mean, we could technically get up there, but... It's too late for me, save yourselves. <laughs> Say what? He said, it's too late for me, save yourselves. <laughs>
down. You're good. Water's coming down. You're good. You're good. You're good. You're good. You're good. You're good. All right, start turning. Driver, just a tad. There you go. Come down. Go drive. There you go, driver. Next, we had Shuey Hill, and this obstacle lives up to its name. Definitely really, really sketchy, guys, with the drop off to your right, and you're having to climb up to your right, so it just makes it really, really difficult. Now, fortunately, we were able to make it all the way up nice. without winching. The others did have to winch, but it was only for safety reasons. We wanted to get through the trail and everyone come out safe. Obstacles on a trail that I've ever done, ever. It's crazy. Nice job, Clayton. Solid work, Clayton. Nice job, Jetson. Thank you, thank you. Set up the winch line for the next one, just in case. Luckily, we didn't have to winch. Expert spotting by Clayton. Just to kind of move me around, so there's no reason to. But there was no reason just to ramp it or send it. There's just crawl it and see what it would do. So it worked out. Let's get up the next one.
Okay, went to the end all the way. The next obstacle was called Rocker Knocker because you are definitely going to use your rockers. We actually did, but what unfortunately we all had to winch up this. We just could not get our tires in the right placement. It was really hot during the day and we were just going to make it easy on ourselves and got everybody up and out so we could get on through the trail. Next up was Axel Hill. We all chose to winch this obstacle. First look, winch. It was absolutely nasty. Which way is it One of the hardest good. obstacles Wait. I think I've ever seen, and I really honestly didn't even want to drive up it. But it was absolutely crazy, guys. Uh, we all chose to winch, like I said, but we wanted to make sure that it, uh, we got up and out. The risk winch, winch, versus winch. reward, it just wasn't worth it.
that was really dumb but i'm really glad we uh really glad we used the winch line um i might have been able to crawl it but it was just way too sketchy um, we're not in any kind of rig or anything like that so uh, you know, we're not in any big rig uh we're just on 37 four and a half inch lift kit so uh, nothing crazy but you know just want to put the winch line on it for safety uh, Hold on, number. The next set of obstacles was called rock pile. Now there are definitely multitude of different options and lines that you can possibly take now it was later in the day so we did choose the easier line but we were able to we actually had to stack a few rocks to get up over the ledge these ledges out there are absolutely massive the camera does not give it justice uh, none of us had to winch over this obstacle and we are on the final one get ready to move Judd. i was telling Judd to get ready to move Now, we were at Yellow Hill. One of the tallest obstacles I think I've ever driven up. It's not so much sketchy as it is you just have to commit. Um, definitely uh, crazy because about three fourths of the way up, there is a nice little bump in the road, especially sketchy for the two doors. That's why the two door chose two winch, just because it was the last obstacle of the day, the last trail of the trip, and uh, didn't want to risk flipping over. But all the four doors were able to make it up. The longer wheelbase did help in that case. Uh, but yeah, you just had to give it throttle and just hope that it went to the top.
Bridget Canyon, the hardest trail in Moab. It was absolutely crazy. I'm so glad that we got to complete it. Um, absolutely gnarly. The view at the top was absolutely amazing. What a great trip, guys. Thank you all for tuning in to this amazing journey back out to Moab. We can't wait to do it again. Please leave a like, leave us a comment, and hit that subscribe button. Moab, what a great trip.